Welcome to part two of my adventure from February 29th, 2024. I switched my attention from the pompanos and rays over to the more traditional tarpon, snook, jacks, redfish, and sea trout. It's a lot of action in this one, so hold on to your horses. Come on, schnooks. Redfish. Oh, there he goes. That was him right there. Jeez. Ah. Why, why, why? Didn't I just cast over here? Alright. Spooked one big snook for the day. Alright. Good thing I kept going. At least they gave myself opportunity. Oh, there's something! Oh, there's a fish! There he is! I can't get a hook into him! Oh, he's trying to get in there! He's in there! in the bushes. Whoa! Get out! Get out! Oh, he's, he's... He's around that one, I think. Come on out. Come on out, bitch. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, manhandling. Oh! Manhandling that snook. Come on! Come on! Come on! Hook, stay in there. Hook, stay in there. Oh, he's almost out. He's almost out of breath. Whoa. Whoa. Come on. This is close to slot. And I got cooler with ice. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Stay with me. Oh, that hook. I don't like the way it's hooked. I don't like the way it's hooked. Come on. Come on. If I can get away from these bushes... I'd feel a lot better. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa, he's a good fighter. I don't like it the way it's... I don't like that way it's hooked in there. Come on. Come on, give up, bitch. Give up. Oh yeah, this could be a slot. Uh, let's hope I find out. Man. He is. Wow. Come on, come on, give up. Oh, give up. Uh, I think he's going to be short. He's going to be short. Whoa, don't drop the rod in the water, Jay. All right. All right. Got the death grip. Jay's got the death grip on him. Whoa. <laughs> That's not the size of the one I saw. But I'll take it. All right, he was a good, but if it turned, look at how easy this thing could have fallen out. He's not slot, but I think he's well. He's thick. He's a thick twenty. Oops! You got to pull him all the way up, Jay. Don't cheat. Uh, he's only twenty-four and a half. Twenty. Twenty-five. I'll take it. Dolphin watching. Yes. Get in there. Get over there. All right. All right. 25 inch. Yes. 25 inch. Yes. I'll take it. After a ray. <laughs> after my failed attempt. Failed attempt at pompano fishing. Back to what I know how to do. Schnook. That was on the NLBN. Although he swallowed it. Uh oh. He, he's got my. Oh. See look at this. Look at this fray. That's where he had me in the barnacles. Around the roots of that mangrove. See that? We're going to have to retie or use the other rod. Nice. All right. <laughs> that was a surprise. He went straight for those bushes. Can't blame him. All right. 
I think I'm going to drop the anchor and re-rig. I knew there was a lot of mullet around here and I wanted to work the area good. And that's what I did. Whoa! Oh, I think it was a tarpon. Whoa! Oh, man. Got off. Wow, what a fish. What a fish. I tried to set the hook hard, but I thought it was a snook. I would have set it harder if I'd known it was a tarpon. Darn, darn, darn. Ooh, he frayed me up. Wow. He frayed me up instantly. Look at that fray job. All right. All right, I just jumped off a giant tarp and I was doing something a little bit different. I was going a lot slower. So, if there's another tarpon, maybe give me another chance go a lot slower here. None of them have rolled, but... God! Get him! This feels more like a jack. This is no tarpon. That ain't no tarpon. All right. Oh, that one hit right away. <laughs> oh, I'm into the jacks now. Bet it's not a pompano. All right. All right. We get three jacks in a row. Is that some kind of straight flush? I don't know. Yes, another one. Three in a row. They're getting bigger. Oh. Wow. Where's the game fish? Tell your buddies, send the snook. Send the snook over. Oh, I got good fish here. That's a snook. Look at that. Oh no, it's a tarpon. Got a tarpon on. Oh, he threw it! Darn! Another tarpon in the throne category. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Oh, he... All right, that got under there pretty good. Whoa! Tarpon just rolled on it, rolled on it right there. I guess I gotta roll it slower under there. Oh, there we go! There we go! There's our tarpon! I got him! I got him this time! Yes! Look at that! <laughs> yes, I think I hooked him this time. Oh, he's gonna go for crazy though. Whoa! Oh, he came off again. 
Oh, for three. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. That was fun. I had my spool loose. So. I was bowing, pretty much. Wow. That was fun. Oh, there was one. Guess they didn't all move out. There we go. There's a baby. There's a baby tarpon. <laughs> There's a baby tarpon. Oh, we let go too. I'm like 0 for 5. <laughs> oh my god. Can't catch that size. What can I catch? There's one. Got him. I'm gonna set the hook good this time. Uh. Oh, for six. <laughs> oh my goodness. I have to check this hook. It's pretty sharp. There's a fish! It's a good fish! God damn! Gotta get tight on him! Nice! It's a nice snook! Alright! Ooh! He's going underneath me! Going underneath me! Nice snook! All right, Jay. All right. I think this is bigger than the other one. Give me a little sleigh ride. Go out. Go out. Yeah. This is how you fight a snook. Let him go away if he wants to. And discourage him from going in there. All right. We're going. We're not going to let him pull us into the mangroves, hopefully. Oh, come on. He's still got some oomph in him. He wants to get in there. He wants to get in there. Whoa, don't get in there. Don't get in there. All right, look at that fish. Are we slot material? Do we have our slots in them? I don't know. I thought the other one was slot and it was way short. It was way short. Let's not count our chickens. But he's going the right way now. He's going the right way now. All right. All right. Oh, I don't like the way it's turned. I do not like the way that's turned. It's turned the... Oh, that is terrible looking. That is a terrible hook set, if I do say so myself. I do not want this fish going backwards. Do not want this one going backwards. Uh, he's still got some oomph. He's got some thickness. Okay, maybe I can get him over here. What? I got him like in the tongue or some crazy position. Alright. You're caught now, bitch. Alright. <laughs> you got caught by Jay. Alright. Alright. You are going to be on the YouTube, mister. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for giving me this little schnook. <laughs> nice. How you doing? Good. Looks like you're doing okay. Yep. Ah, uh, no, I don't think so. I think he's short. Well, I'm gonna find out. Looks like he's about 26, maybe. 
Now 25, 24. It's getting shorter. <laughs> yeah, it was fun. He tried to get me in the trees. Ah, uh, yeah, I lost like I'm um, 0 for 6 on the tarpon. <laughs> Kept jumping off tarpon around the corner there. It's been a great day. Thank you. Oh, God! Got him! Wrong, so not this time. Yes. Ow. <laughs> that was a wild one. There was no keeping up with him. <laughs> wow. That was the big one again. God. Look at that. That was a 50 pounder. Oh. That was the same one I missed before. Huge river tarpon. Oh. That one, I needed to see that one go airborne. Come on. Wow. That was huge. Little blue heron right there. Whoop. Not too happy. Oh, Jay. All right, folks, that's going to be a wrap. I started off this day looking for Pompano. Uh, where I'd seen him the day before. However, the wind was different, the tide was different, everything was different. And as you, as you may have seen in that other episode, all I did was snag a bunch of rays thinking they were pompano. That was kind of bizarre. I'd never seen rays hitting on the surface like that. So then I switched my attention to the snook and the tarpon and the jacks, and um, I had a great time. Something... You guys should uh, keep in mind, I noticed that the mullet were all gathered up the day before. They were not. Um, th three days before, conditions were totally different. The snook were not biting. The water was too cold. This was the fourth day of clear skies and sunny weather where um, those cold water temperatures finally got to warm up. I didn't have a thermometer, but if I was going to guess, I would say it hit like 69 to 71 degrees. And um, the fish I don't think I'd eaten in a long time, and they were kind of hungry. So that made a huge difference. Moving forward into the spring, I expect um, there to be more days like this. I expect the fish to be hungry. Uh, I expect the water to be warmer. I'm not expecting too many more severe cold fronts. There's going to be some snaps, but not severe fronts. So the fishing is looking great from here on out for all my Florida anglers. So get out there if you can and tight lines. Thanks for watching, Jay.